Hi guys! I know it has been so long since I've made a video. I'm really sorry about that. I have had a lot going on for the past several months. Um, I'm not really going to get into it here, but um, it, it was a lot and it took a toll on me physically and mentally. So I just needed time to rest and take care of myself. And then for a while, Alden wasn't feeling good. So I was taking care of him and all of that. So I do have my retainer thing in. So if I sound a little weird when I'm talking, I'm sorry. I'm trying to keep wearing it as often as I can. Um, because for so long I wasn't, and I wasn't used to wearing it, so I feel like I have a slight lisp, <laughs> and it's even bothering me, but I need to keep it in, so. Anyway, I have a what's in my purse video for you. I feel like it's been a while since I've done one, so why not come back with doing my favorite types of videos? So, I don't have the brand or name of this bag at all. I found it on Poshmark and it was new with tags but like there was no brand name on the tags. There's no brand name in the purse but I'm obsessed with it. Um, it came a few days ago and so I've been using it ever since. I love it. I'm obsessed with it so let me go ahead and show you what it is. It is this purse right here. It has crossbody strap, or you could use it on your shoulder. There's a hidden pocket right there. The bottom has all of these gold studs. And of course, the two top handles and a zipper top. And then the inside is cheetah print. You guys know I love cheetah print so much. It is my favorite thing. So I guess let's just dive on in and see what's in my bag. <laughs> um, okay. First things first, I have a pack of the Nerd Gummy Clusters because this is my favorite candy in the entire world right now. My fiancé and I are both addicted to it, so I always have a pack in my purse. My keys are right on top. Um, I have had somebody ask me if I would ever do a what's on my keychain. Um... I can show you, but it's really not, like, anything that great right now. I don't have very much on here. I do have my initial keychain that came with this tassel and this little glitter-filled ball. I have this little cactus, this gold anchor... And aside from my keys, I have this pocket knife that is shaped like a key. So that's really all that's on my little keychain thing right now. Maybe I will spruce it up one day, get some more cute keychains, but we will see. I have my little earbuds in there and I will say these are lasting a lot longer than the first pair that I got from Five Below. Um, they're holding a charge. Um, I can listen to or I can use them to listen to music or YouTube or whatever for quite a long time before they have to charge again. So that is really nice. I have uh, my crisp apple scent hand sanitizer. I have got to keep this cloth in my purse 
because I always have to wipe my glasses off. It is so frustrating. Um, just a little pill container. Um, I have a... I what? I have a couple of mini Stroop waffles in here. Um, I actually have several different snacks in here. So I have mini Stroop waffles. I have a Reese's white chocolate egg. And I also have a protein bar. I'm sure a lot of you heard of Lady Boss. Um, I ordered their sample pack of the protein bars to give it a try. I have not tried this flavor yet. It's chocolate chip cookie dough. I did try the peanut butter. The peanut butter is so, so good. And then there's a birthday cake flavor. Um, one thing I will say, though, is I just found out Lady Boss is closing. And that is the only protein bar I've ever tried that tasted really good. Every other kind on the market sucks. They don't taste good to me at all. They're so disgusting. So I'm really sad that that company is closing. Um, little native deodorant. Uh, my honey and milk sleep mask. I think it's uh, my light that's just too bright. I keep a mask on me at all times. We don't really need to wear masks everywhere around here, but when I do have to go into my doctor's appointments, they want you to wear a mask. So I always make sure to have one on me. My handy dandy calculator. Um, I also have my, I can't remember how to say the name of this, but, um, the hand cream I got in that one All True subscription box. I think that's the name of the box. Um, my peppermint oil roller ball. My little compact mirror. I think this is a receipt from McDonald's. Um, I am using this at the moment just to keep change in. A few different pens. And my little notebook to make lists for going to the store or writing anything down that I just don't want to forget or whatnot. Um, I forgot I threw this in my purse. This is the Alice in Wonderland Oracle cards. I got them off of Amazon. They're really, really, really pretty cards. They are holographic, as you can tell by the box. Uh, but they just intrigue me. I'm learning a lot more about that stuff. I don't believe that oracle cards or tarot cards are evil or anything like that. I honestly just think they're something fun to do. But I had those in there. Um, oh, I got this in the mail the other day. I have a free $5 for Michael's. But I need to use it before the 29th because it expires. I have a receipt from the grocery store from yesterday. And then I have one open pack of gum, one unopened pack of gum. And I switched to this wallet with all of the spikes on it. Um, I just feel like I haven't used this wallet enough. So holds everything that I need and even though there is this middle zippered pocket there um I feel like there's a hole right there and 
change could easily fall out of it, which is why I'm using this separately to hold my change. I forgot about this! Um, I have an unopened pack of Animal Crossing Amiibo cards. This is Series 5. I have to open these and see what cards I got. Um, and then this is super random. I have, um, I've been getting those little Disney Dorables, um, like blind boxes from Target. And you get two to three mystery Disney characters. And this is one of the dwarves from Snow White. And then this is Eeyore. I love Eeyore so much. And let's see. That is it for that part of the purse. So this purse does not have two slip pockets in the front and a zippered pocket in the back like normal. So in the back right here, there are some card slots just to keep some cards. And the zippered pocket is in the front of the purse. So in my slip or my zippered pocket, I have an unopened pack of gum, some Neosporin, some Aleve, a lens wipe for my glasses, some band-aids, and a uh, USB port, and then this is a nice size like hidden pocket. In the hidden pocket I have my Treat Beauty Lip Balm, just for easy access to it. And then I also have this Milani lip oil. It's the Fruit Fetish lip oil, and it's in Strawberry Melon. I highly recommend you guys check this out. It smells so good. It has this giant doe foot applicator but it smells like those little rollerball lip glosses you used to get from like the skating rink as a kid it smells so good and then I'm also keeping my two little perfume little spray bottles in that hidden pocket It is such a nice size bag. I just feel like the wallet goes so well with it because the studs on the bottom of the purse and the studs on the wallet, I feel like it all just kind of ties in together. Uh, I have so many snacks, but I feel like you can never have too many snacks in your purse just because you never know. You're in the car, you get stuck in traffic or something, and you need to eat something. Right. I don't really have a particular order of how things go in this purse. And then my gum. I'm going to leave the receipts out of my purse so that I can scan them. Put my keys right back on top. Is that not one of the cutest purses? 
And I like that it's green because the majority of my purses are black. And I just, I love the gold studs on the bottom. It is so well made. I wish I could figure out who it's by. Um, where it came from. I just know that I found it on Poshmark and I had to have it. But I'm going to open these Amiibo cards and see who I get. I like have an addiction to buying these. Oh, okay, she's cute. Okay, so right off the bat, we have Quinn. We have Azalea. I don't think I've ever heard of this character. Um, Tian Shang? I don't know if I'm saying his name right. Oh, he is such a cute penguin. Chabwick. He's adorable. He reminds me of Hugsy from Friends. Oh, she's cute. And then I got Sasha. And then, so you get six cards total, and then the sixth card is always a non-playable character. It's just somebody you can invite to your island. So this one is CJ. And he's the guy that, like, when your island is having a fishing tournament, he's there. Um, stuff like that. So, yeah, I, I have been addicted to buying Animal Crossing Amiibo packs since my store finally got them, because for the longest time they didn't have them, and I've thought about buying several packs, um, and just, like, setting them aside and letting them add up and then doing a video strictly like unboxing a ton of Animal Crossing Amiibos. If you guys don't want to see that, let me know. That's totally fine. But I feel like I'm such a nerd and I love Animal Crossing so much. I would love to do that video. Um, I remember somebody asking if I could do like a, um, like, I, if I could stream Animal Crossing so you guys could, like, watch me play it or show my island. I honestly don't know how I could do that because I have a Switch Lite. I don't have a normal Nintendo Switch. Um, so there's, like, really no way of doing that except recording the screen of my Switch. And I don't think that the footage would turn out super good. So maybe one day I will be able to do that. But yeah, I just wanted to come back and say hi to you guys. And I really miss you. And I appreciate you sticking with me for so long, even when I've been gone for a while. Um, I promise I will talk about what I was going through really soon. Um, it was hard. It was very physically and mentally draining, emotionally as well. Um, I had some really, really bad days. So I will come back and I will explain all of that to you guys. But I appreciate you sticking with me for this long. I love you guys so much. I feel like you guys are the best subscribers. Um... And my channel just keeps growing. So for any of you newbies out there, thank you for subscribing. I really appreciate you. I know I sound so weird with the stamp retainer in. I'm so sorry. But um, I really want to come back and do all the videos again. I want to start doing more clean with me's. I would love to do crafting videos. Um, obviously more purse videos like what else would I do? 
Um, I would love to like unbox a ton of Animal Crossing amiibos. Let me know if you want to see that or not. Because if not, I will save that for like me to do on my own. Um, I do also want to show you, I picked up this notebook from Target earlier today. And I think it's so freaking pretty. It almost looks brighter yellow on screen, but it's way more of a mustard yellow. It even has this pocket on the front of it and I just love the layout so it says like you know January through December with all of the the dates like the first through the 31st and each page says subject it's just it's so cute and it's like flexible but it's not too flimsy I really love this notebook so I just wanted to make my comeback and let you guys know that I am okay. I wasn't okay for a while there, but I am okay now. And I really want to start doing videos again. Um, leave me any suggestions of what videos you guys want to see. Um, because I would love for you guys to tell me like what else you're interested in seeing. Like I said, I'd love to do craft videos, more clean with me's, um, I can do more vlogs, uh, obviously purse videos, um, just let me know. I would love to do, um, whatever you guys would like to see. I definitely need to go through my makeup and declutter a lot, so I'm thinking of doing a decluttering video soon so yeah I'm gonna write down a ton of ideas that I want to start doing um but also please leave suggestions down below of what you would like to see and I will add those suggestions to my list and I promise you I will do my best to film those kinds of videos but with that being said I am so tired it's only going, I think it's like only nine o'clock and I think I'm going to go to bed, but I promise I won't take that long to come back and make a video. Um, it, I, like I said, it was a lot. Whenever I come back and I explain everything that happened, you guys will understand why I was gone for so long. But anyways, I hope you guys have a wonderful night. I hope you have a great rest of your week. Tomorrow's Friday. Woohoo! So, uh, yeah, I'll talk to you guys again really soon. Bye!